here and thank you for joining me again on this episode of a different lens as i mentioned in the previous recording uh, some of the things that i i want to try to do is read to you directly some of uh, my own writings and including uh, materials that i've collected from individuals across my time and travels uh, in pakistan so I'll just get started. Today we delve into a topic that weighs heavily on my heart. The climate of fear and repression in Pakistan is reminiscent of some of the darkest days of history. In recent years, Pakistan has witnessed a chilling erosion of human rights accompanied by a growing atmosphere of fear and intimidation. A climate has emerged that can only be described as Nazi-type fear, an environment where dissent is met with brutality, the media is muzzled, and journalists who dare to speak truth to power pay the ultimate price. As I speak these words, I'm haunted by the faces of brave journalists who have been silenced, those who have fought valiantly to expose corruption, defend human rights, and uphold the principles of a free and independent press. In Pakistan, the very essence of democracy is being suffocated. Activists, lawyers, and ordinary citizens who dare to raise their voices against injustice face harassment, arrest, and torture. Their loved ones live in constant fear, unsure of what the next day may bring. The media, once a beacon of truth and accountability, now finds itself shackled. Journalists walk a treacherous path, knowing that their words may cost them their lives. News outlets are coerced into self-censorship, leaving the public uninformed and democracy crippled. But even in the midst of this darkness, a flicker of hope remains. Brave individuals driven by an unwavering commitment to justice continue to raise their voices. They refuse to be silenced, knowing that the pursuit of truth and freedom comes at a great cost. 
These individuals are the epitome of resilience and courage. They inspire us with their unwavering determination to fight for human rights, even when the odds are stacked against them. Through a different lens, I aim to shed light on these unsung heroes, to amplify their stories and to challenge the world, to stand in solidarity with them. We must not let their sacrifices go unnoticed or their voices unheard. I call upon governments, international organizations, and individuals around the world to unite in their support for the people of Pakistan. Let us condemn the suppression of human rights, demand the protection of journalists, and advocate for the restoration of a free and independent media. In closing, let us remember the importance of a free press and the critical role it plays in any functioning democracy. It is our collective duty to ensure that the voices of the oppressed are heard and the pursuit of truth is safeguarded. Thank you for joining me on this journey through a harrowing reality. Together, I hope we can continue to view the world through a different lens and work towards a future where human rights are cherished, justice prevails, and freedom reigns. Thank you.